Welcome back to Cruising America, everyone. Today we're visiting the Square Tower House Overlook in Mesa Verde National Park. We're Steve and Kathleen. We're Cruising America in our 35-foot fifth-wheel RV, chasing 70-degree weather year-round. If you'd like to watch our previous videos, please click the Cruising America playlist link in the description below this video. Otherwise, enjoy our current episode starting now. Thanks to the Wuhan virus and subsequent staff planning decisions made months prior, Square Tower House tours were not available. If they had been offered, please note they would have only been available mid-May through mid-October. We did, however, take the short hike to the Overlook Point. Longhouse is different than most cliff dwellings in the park. It goes up instead of in because of the shallow overhang. Built and occupied between 1200 and 1300 AD, the dwelling had 49 to 60 rooms and 8 kivas. The 27-foot high square tower is also the tallest Pueblo structure in Mesa Verde National Park. Mesa Verde receives an average of 18 inches of precipitation annually, and has a frost-free growing season averaging about 150 days. Tree ring and pollen evidence suggests conditions were similar when Pueblins lived here. Archaeologists found thousands of small corn cobs, dried squash stems and seeds, and the occasional cache of corn kernels or dried beans, which remind us of how successful ancestral Pueblo farmers were. Alcove sites like this tend to be quite cold in winter, but kivas are well insulated by the earth around them. Over the centuries, most kiva roofs collapsed, but partial roofs are still intact here in Square Tower House and at Long House. All archaeological sites, especially those with standing architecture like Square Tower House, require continued assessment and maintenance. Thanks for watching our latest episode of Cruising America. To see more of our videos, click the link to our channel in the description below. If you like our videos, please click the subscribe button, then click the bell next to it. YouTube will then send you emails telling about our new videos once they're posted.